Hello and welcome to Gaming Flaw. In today's video, we'll be walking you through the process of replacing the SSD storage inside the Asus ROG Ally. If this is your first time visiting us, we extend a warm welcome to you and encourage you to subscribe to our channel for more useful content like this. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button as it helps us grow and reach more people. Let's dive in and get that SSD storage replaced. Absolutely! It's essential to prioritize safety when working with any electronic device. Before we begin with the actual process, please make sure your ASUS ROG Ally is completely turned off. This helps to prevent any unintended damage that might occur due to residual electricity in the system. Once you've turned off your device, we're ready to start. Let's dive into the process. Great, with the device powered off, we can now move on to the next step, removing the screws from the back. Flip your ASUS ROG Ally over, and you'll see a total of six screws. Next, gather your tools. You'll need a laptop repair kit, which typically includes the necessary screwdrivers for various types of screws you'll encounter in your device. Additionally, you'll need an opening pick. This thin, flat tool is ideal for carefully prying open the tight back cover of your ASUS ROG Ally remember, patience and caution are crucial here, you don't want to rush and end up damaging your device. Once you have your tools ready, we can move forward with the process. Once all the screws are sufficiently loosened, it's time to use the opening pick. Carefully insert the opening pick into the small gap between the back cover and the body of your ASUS ROG Ally gently run the pick along the edges, prying the cover up as you go. It's important to take your time during this step to avoid damaging your device. Once you've worked the pick around the entire device, the back cover should come off with minimal force. You'll then have access to the internal components of your ASUS ROG Ally. Safety first. Before proceeding with the SSD installation, it is crucial to disconnect the battery to ensure there's no power flowing through your ASUS ROG Ally. This will help prevent any accidental short circuits while you're working on the internals of the device. Locate the battery connector, which is typically a small plug connected to the motherboard by a thin cable. Carefully unplug this connector by gently pulling it straight out. Make sure not to yank or twist it, as these delicate components can be damaged easily. Now that your device is completely powered down, you're ready to install the new SSD. Next, you will find a black flap located between the fans. Gently lift this up to expose the SSD. You'll notice a small screw securing the SSD. Using your screwdriver, carefully remove this. With the screw removed, you can now safely take out the old SSD. Now take your new SSD package. I've picked up my new SSD from E2Z Store, a highly recommended authorized seller in India. I've managed to snag a 2TB Micron SSD at an excellent price point from them. The best part? E2Z Store assures the genuineness of their SSDs, providing a reassuring 3-year warranty to back up their claim. So, if you're in India and looking for a trusted SSD source, the E2Z Store could be a great option for you. Now, let's get back to the installation process. When installing the new SSD, remember to align it properly with the slot and then gently push it in. Replace the screw to secure the SSD in place. Keep in mind that following this guide implies you are replacing your existing SSD, which will erase all existing files on your current SSD. Therefore, ensure you have backed up any important data before proceeding with this replacement. Now, you've successfully installed a new SSD in your ASUS ROG Ally. Once you've installed the new SSD, remember to reconnect the battery plug. Afterward, carefully reattach the back cover.
Once this is done, it's time to put those screws back in. Make sure to tighten them sufficiently, but be careful not to apply excessive force. And there you have it, you've just successfully replaced your SSD storage. We're now at the final stage of our SSD installation. With the new SSD firmly in place, it's time to bring your Asus ROG Ally back to life. Please note, it's crucial to plug your charger back in before hitting the power button. This will ensure a safe and proper restart after the hardware change. With your Asus ROG Ally now successfully booted, you'll notice it initially launches into BIOS mode. Tap on Advanced Mode. Tap Advanced again. Tap on Asus Cloud Recovery which allows you to install Windows 11 and all drivers on your Asus ROG Ally without any hassle. Once you tap on it, you need to go through every step of installation process. You have to connect your device to a good Wi-Fi connection. After establishing the connection, please click on the OK button. This will initiate the search for a new download of Windows 11 specifically for your Asus ROG Ally. Click on Next to begin the download process. If the download fails, please attempt it again. It will take some time, so grab a cup of coffee. Once you are done, click Confirm to continue. This will now start the installation process. If you are using a new SSD card, you can select No when the backup pop-up appears. Confirm Yes. Windows 11 download will begin. The Windows 11 download process takes quite a while. It's recommended to keep your device plugged in and attend to other tasks while it installs. In my experience, it took about 40 minutes to finish. When Windows 11 loads, please do not take any action. It will continue to restart in order to install all drivers one by one. Please be patient and do not touch your device until you reach the Windows 11 welcome screen where you can select your language.
Once the installation process is complete, a screen will appear allowing you to select your preferred language. Simply choose your language and proceed to complete the setup process for Windows 11. That's it for this guide, folks. You have now successfully upgraded the SSD on your Asus ROG Ally Remember to always back up your data before making any hardware changes. If you found this guide helpful, please leave a like and share it with others who might find it useful. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. If you have any questions or face any issues, feel free to leave a comment down below, and we'll do our best to assist you. Thanks for watching, and until next time, stay connected with Gaming Flaw.